Hello everyone, this is uh, Inspire 2016. So we would like to give you a free tarot card reading for everyone. So the way we want to read the card is using the six card uh, major arcana layout. So the first card would represent how you feel about yourself right now. The second card will be representing what you most wanted at this moment. And the third card will represent your fears out of the situation that you have been going through. And the fourth card will represent what is going for you. And the fifth card will represent what is going against you. And the last card will be the sixth card represent the outcome according to your situations or the questions that you ask. So all of the spread will be presented based on your zodiac signs, that means your sun sign, rising sign, your moon sign, or whatever sign you have as the one that you hold dear in your deepest heart. So let's begin the reading. I hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get the instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, YouTube. Thanks. Hello Gemini, this is Inspire 2016 with your weekly tarot reading for the week, commencing the 20th until the 26th of June 2016. The first card for you is representing, how do you feel about yourself? Your card is, the moon. You feel confused, vulnerable and full of doubts. However, all is not as it seems feel the fear and do it anyway, because all will turn out well. Expect the new and unexpected to show up and welcome it into your life. Your turbulent emotions are muddying the waters so step back and try to find clarity of mind, no matter how difficult this proves to be. Things may seem tough or confusing but stick with it, it's right for you. The second card for you is representing. What do you want most right now? Your card is The Tower You're probably looking for an easy solution to a difficult problem. However in life, turmoil and upheaval often bring about positive change, just not quite as we would like it. Seize this opportunity that is forcing change as a chance for a new beginning. The third card for you is representing your fears. Your card is the devil. You are afraid that it's out of control. You simply cannot resist this passionate attraction. Despite the fact it's addictive and unlikely to be right, you just can't stop yourself. Whatever it is, a passion for someone who's not good for you, money deals that are too good to be true or any other kind of temptation, try to resist as it is unlikely to have a positive outcome. If you're feeling low in self-belief and self-worth and doubt your abilities, don't. Have confidence in yourself, it's not too late to change direction. The fourth card for you is representing, what is going for you? Your card is, the sun. The sun is shining on you, it's your time for success joy and happiness. You will feel confident and full of vitality. It's a time to celebrate with friends and loved ones, perhaps enjoy a well-earned holiday, a time of pleasure and good news around children or the conception or birth of a longed-for baby. If you are not feeling this way take heart, you will enter this period soon. The fifth card for you is representing what is going against you? Your card is The Strength Your negativity and lack of self-control are your real enemies. If you are finding certain addictions in your life are taking a hold, be it smoking or drinking for example, look inward for your heart's true strength and self-belief. Change your attitude and be positive and you will reap great rewards. The last card for you is representing, the likely outcome that you may have. Your card is, the star. This is a time of good luck and fortune, 
perhaps after a period of struggle and heartache. Good health, possibly after a time of illness, and good fortune will give you a new zest for life. If considering a new love affair, new job, career change, or travel, then go for it. You may also receive some unexpected gifts. Last but not least, the guidance card for you is Realizations and Epiphanies. The changes you're experiencing are influenced by internal processes. You've been recognizing important truths, and now you're questioning parts of your life that you once took for granted. You've arrived at some new insights that are making you reconsider your previous choices. What you once felt comfortable with now makes you uncomfortable. You received this card as acknowledgement of this development, and also as guidance to take your time in making life decisions and adjustments. Do your research, get support, and adopt the changes as you feel ready. After all, you don't want to increase your stress levels with any radical shifts you're not prepared to make. Now that you've had these realizations, you'll make positive changes at a natural and healthy pace. Your new outlook will lead the way, without stress or worries. Some more additional meanings of the card is Meditation, a spiritual path, channeling, and relationships growing apart. I hope that you enjoy everything and if you like the reading just please click subscribe and you will get the instant notifications every time we publish a new video right to your uh, YouTube. Thanks.